on your side tonight looking at the differences between BB guns and handguns and what it means for you and the law. This all comes after two Iowa State students were arrested after police say they were spotted carrying BB guns around campus. These are the guns police tell us they were seen with last Thursday. They're BB guns, but Iowa State police got reports that they had a rifle. It's something that has local gun shop owners reminding people how to be safe. Local 5 on your side's Erica Rankin is warning you about how poorly this could have ended. These are two 9mm handguns that look very similar to the BB gun that Iowa State police officers obtained after last Thursday night's incident. And because of how real that BB gun looked, officers say this situation could have turned deadly. The, the witnesses who saw it were very clear that they saw a handgun and rifle. When the caller said they saw men with guns, officers treated the call as seriously as an active shooter situation. As soon as I saw the pictures, I was like, oh, this could have turned out really bad for, for these individuals. And Michael Newton, chief of ISU police, says BB guns are considered weapons. And it's a prohibited by our, our Department of Residence contracts and our university policies. Local 5 on your side talked with the owner of JLM Gun Shop, Mike Sport showed us the difference between a handgun and a BB gun, but really, they look the same. That's the problem with people running around with BB guns. Uh, they look very, they look exactly like a real firearm. But he suggests if you have one to add color to help distinguish a difference. Uh, you'd want to paint the end of it red or something or paint it a weird, you know, something to make it obvious that it's not a real firearm. And Sporer says the biggest danger with a BB gun is for the person carrying it. In a split second, they have to know if that's a real gun that's pointed at them or not. Because something meant for innocent fun could turn deadly. They don't think it out to the end where, hey, I might encounter a policeman that thinks this is real. And since a BB gun is considered a weapon, Sporer says you can't shoot one in Des Moines. In the eyes of most of our, certainly our suburbs and the city of Des Moines, uh, you're not allowed to discharge them in the city limits. All of the people involved in the incident will be referred to the Dean of Students Office to see if the university will take any further action. In Urbandale, Erica Rankin, Local 5 News, we're Iowa.